hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here thank you so much for tuning in if you're an oldie thank you so much for sticking with me my name is adora uzoma and in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to um source for your application form if you're someone who is looking to apply for citizenship or work permit or study permit or even if you want to just you know go through a document checklist i'm going to be showing you where you can source for all these forms because i realize it's a challenge for some people when they want to you know embark on their immigration journey to canada it's difficult for them to actually find where they can retrieve this form and it's pretty easy actually so in this video it's going to be a pretty straightforward video i'm going to be showing you where you can retrieve each and every form you're looking for provided you have the code of the form if it's iim 5583 you can just like filter it and it will just bring it out for you if it's imm 5484 you know provided you know the document you're actually looking for um it's going to bring that out for you so without much further ado we're going to head right into the video um so just go on google so once you get to google search for how to um find an application form and it's just pretty easy the very first um link you're seeing here which says find an ircc application package of form so just go ahead and click on that so once you do that it brings you right to this page this is actually the immigration website page so you're not going to like a third party page or wherever if you look at it up here you can see you're actually on canada ca website so this is the legitimate site where you can always trust so it says here find an IRCC application package or form so it's gonna ask you here what are you looking for are you looking for an application package or are you looking for a particular form or a checklist so let's go ahead and click on the second option and then it tells you here um, make sure um, you clear your browsing history which is your cache before downloading any form um, when we update our forms if you don't clear your history your browser might still open the old forms so this is very very important to note open the file in acrobat reader 10 or higher on your computer not on a tablet or mobile phone uh, you can also get help if you're having any issues doing that you can get help to open a form there's a link here for you to do that or to fill out one in the help center so there are resources here for here for you to that can assist you with all that okay so scrolling down you can see here that there are about 218 entries like there are so many forms so if you're someone who is looking to apply for citizenship for a minor that's the form code over there and once you uh, click on that you see here on my right hand side it's just download and then once i go to my downloads and uh, once i go to my acrobat reader over here and then what i will just do is uh open and once i open that's the form so make sure you have the recent acrobat reader for you to uh open your form and fill it out so that's it over here so application for canadian citizenship for minor under 18 years of age etc so let's go back to that um screen so i'm gonna x this out and then uh, if you're someone who is looking for application for a study permit made outside of canada you know you go ahead and open the form it says here um this was updated october 2024 so this is a recent form and like you said earlier make sure that you clear your browsing history so you don't download the old form right so once you click on that it will download and then you go to your adobe go to um open and then that's the form over here which is imm 1294e and then it's gonna come out here for you just give it a second and that's it here application for study permits made outside of canada so this is a very resourceful uh link for those who don't know where to source for you know application forms and uh, once you just go here you can just search let's look for imm uh 55a3 oh i have to give a space 
55A3. So this is a document checklist for students applying for a work permit, right? Once you click on that, you can see here that is it was updated last October 2024. So this is where you can find whatever application form you're looking for on the CIC website. If you're looking for like a document checklist for like a temporary resident visa, I think it's IMM 5484. Yeah, there it is. Document checklist for temporary resident visa made outside of Canada. You click on that and then go ahead and download the form. So yeah, it's pretty, pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Um, I think this will help anyone who is looking to apply for you know something. So just go here, find an IRCC package. I'm going to leave the link in the video in the description box for you to uh, click on. And then here is also an application package. So select a category um, if you want to apply for like a passport, then it says here, find a passport form right and then select any any application type if you use a passport or travel document for non-canadian certified true copy of canadian travel documents or whatever that applies to you um this website or this link is very very handy it comes in very very handy uh, let's see here for someone who wants to um, apply for citizenship select the category if it's a canadian citizenship proof of citizenship assistance or, or records this comes in very handy Select an application package. Um, if you're an adult, 18 or and above, or a minor, you know, all that comes in here. Then you go ahead and click on the application package and it gives you everything on this page. So, yeah, so let me know if this is helpful. Like I said, I'll put the link down below for you to have access to. If you have any questions, do put them down in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.